They can only envision by what you're saying, they can see it in their imagination. And as you're explaining, as you're talking to them, as you're painting the picture, as you're telling the story, the client imagination, the client's imagination starts to run, starts to roam. And that is called painting a picture in their imagination. And you're doing it with words and they're godlike. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy Elliott. In this video, I want to talk to you about how to be the greatest storyteller that ever lived. Now, if you know uh, a little bit about what I do, my background is sales. I've been in sales since I'm 18. I'm 44 years old and, you know, 26 years of selling. By the way, write this down. Sales is the transfer of belief. Sales is the transfer of emotion. How is all that done? It's done by a lot of micro skills, okay? Hands, posture, smiling with your eyes, smiling with your teeth, feet, the way that we move, body language, voice tonality, head nods, uh, lots of stuff like that. By the way, those things are used when you tell a story. I want you to understand something, okay? By the way, your words, your language, you gotta learn new language, you gotta learn new words. You gotta have a different vocabulary. If you sound like everybody else, no one else is gonna listen to you. You gotta sound different. I've been in sales for a long time, and I wanna tell you that the art of storytelling is the greatest way to paint a picture. Kind of write down a couple things that I wanna, I wanna give you six bullet points that we're gonna talk about. You ready? Number one, write down, paint pictures. Painting, not a picture, but a, a conversation is a canvas and, and you're the one holding the paintbrush. And you're going to paint a picture of how they see what it is that you're talking about. So paint pictures, ready? Tell stories, okay, you gotta tell stories. Sell ideas, write that down, sell ideas sell situations, influence, persuade. These six things, paint pictures, right? Tell stories, sell ideas, sell situations, influence, persuade. They're all done by words and words are godlike. I want you to write this down, words are godlike. And I want you to understand what I mean by that. So I want you to envision that you're talking to someone who doesn't have eyes. They have no eyes, so they can't see they can only envision by what you're saying, they can see it in their imagination. And as you're explaining, as you're talking to them, as you're painting the picture, as you're telling the story, the client imagination, the client's imagination starts to run, starts to roam. And that is called painting a picture in their imagination. And you're doing it with words and they're godlike. Guys, I talk to, 10, 20, 30,000 people on a stage all the time. And I want to tell you when you're going to go move 10, 20, 30,000 people, you're going to do it with stories. You're not going to give information like an order taker and people are going to leave that room differently and want to make decisions that they normally wouldn't make. They're going to need to be moved. They need a vision. They need a movement. And who's that vision, that movement, that is you. And who's going to be the one that are going to, that's going to give them the words, give them the power, give them the courage, give them the passion. Who's going to be the passionate one? Who's going to be the one who's going to get them to the place that you want them to go? It's going to be you. And how are you going to do it? You're going to do it with the art of storytelling. Now, I want you to just, and by the way, this isn't going to be a long video. We could end this video right now in the little part that I already told you, if you could just emulate it, you would change many people's lives and you would always uh, get your message across to people and they would understand what it is that you want and they would want to be a part of it, okay? I want you to understand when I'm talking to someone, eye contact, super important. People wanna feel significant, they wanna feel important. My eyes are always scoping if I'm talking to a crowd of people. Everyone, I'm looking directly at you and you and you, or if I'm just right here with you and I'm doing face-to-face -face selling, I'm going to look at you in your eyes and I'm gonna to talk to you like you're important. I'm gonna to talk to you like you're significant. I'm gonna to talk to you like you matter. I'm gonna to talk to you with my heart. I'm gonna to talk to you like I believe in me and I'm the expert. And I'm gonna to talk to you like I believe in you and I believe in this thing that we can do together, okay? And my courage and my belief and the way that I care about you. Remember when you care about more uh, somebody more than they care about themselves, they will love you, okay? We're in an era right now where customer service is in the trash can. People really don't care about anybody anymore. Ever since COVID, people wore masks, stood six feet apart, and just didn't 
talk anymore. Uh, communication, we were made for communion. God made us to be together and we got separated. And when that happened, the world has missed that thing. There is a magical thing called oxytocin. It's called a love chemical. Your body creates it. And when you talk and you tell stories, you make people feel powerful, you make them feel comfortable, and the oxytocin flows through their body and the chemicals released and they love you. These are things that you can do. This is a skill, it is an art, and anything that can be taught is a skill, and if you can learn it, it's because it's a skill, and the art of storytelling you can all learn. If you want to be the greatest, the greatest salesperson that's ever lived, the greatest leader, what is a leader? Leadership is a person that influences the thoughts, the emotions, and the actions, and the feelings of another human being, okay? And that is the art of storytelling. That is what we do. And we are the leader and the leader is, 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 is painting the picture for others, is selling the idea, okay? And we're using that by allowing other people to put themselves either in our shoes or in someone else's shoes so they can understand what it is that we're delivering. The delivery is what separates you from everyone. You could know the same information that I know, but if I can deliver it better than you, I'm going to kick your ass. If I can deliver it better than you, you maybe couldn't change that person's life, but I could. Does that make sense? You couldn't close me on the deal, okay, but that person could because they delivered it different, okay? So anyways, guys, this video, I didn't want to make it really long. I wanted to make it kind of short. I wanted to talk to you about how to, how to be the greatest storyteller in the world, which I just told you. You need to change. You need to become somebody different. You need to care more. When you're telling a story, I think one of the things that people can feel when you tell a story is your intentions and your heart. They can feel and they can tell where you truly are and where you are will move them if you're in a right place to be in that right place with you. That's your job. Face-to-face -face selling, okay? Preacher in the pulpit, on the phone talking to someone, asking your boss for a job, raise, anything. You gotta be a storyteller. That's how people really understand the best. That's how they get the message the best. So, I love you guys. Uh, if you're watching this and you're like, hey Andy, dude, I wanna do that. Well, number one, I train and I coach people how to be public speakers every single day. I do it every single day, okay? There's a description box below, guys, down in the YouTube section. You see where it says YouTube description? Below. There's a little link that says Coach with Andy. If you want to be the greatest speaker that ever lived, if you want to be the greatest person to articulate their words, right, and, and just be awesome and kick ass and build a big business or train and coach your sales team, maybe it's just you. Whatever it is, I'd love to help you. You guys can click on that link below, answer a couple questions, and I'll reach out to you in the next 24 hours. Guys, kick ass. Have a blessed day. Love you guys. See you in the next video. Comment below. Tell me what your favorite part about this video was. Okay, Share it with someone who needed to hear this. Let's go.